Start of the first day of 72 hours remaining. Hello everybody, this is Oob Nonami signing in from my room to bring you let's play of oh, Zelda Majora's Mask. We are back. We have the bunny hood. We have our three bottles. Yes, we do. And we are looking oh so fast later today. And today we will be continuing on the storyline. We are going to go to Zora's Cavern. Or Zora Lake, I mean. My bad. Meh. Standard blah blah blah. I have a sword and a shield. My sword is looking oh so fabulous lately. If you have not seen the last video, please do so. I did a lot of stuff that would not make sense. Like th getting this. Like seriously, this looks awesome. Right, just look at how my slashes go now. And my damage will be oh so much more. Let's see, I think I can just call Epona, right? Epona, Epona. Yep, now I can just call Epona whenever I want. Yay! There you are, Epona. What are you doing over at the Stargazer place? You know he doesn't like horses climbing on his big telescope lens thingy. But that's okay, Epona. I love you. So let's go to the go. Oh man. Wow, I'm glitching. Um. Oh, 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 okay. Um, that, that, um, uh. Okay, Pona, uh, you're a bit, uh, glitched right now. Here, let me just move over here and, uh, call you from here. That's a lot better, okay. Maybe Epona will come now. Come on over here, Epona. Come on. Come on. There, whoa. How, how'd you get over there, Epona? Are you a magic horse now or something? Did, did you turn magic since I was last not looking? Uh-oh, 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 bomb. Whoa, I didn't hurt. Okay, about time. Okay, these, man. That was like a long time for nothing because I was literally just stuck in that for a while. I don't know what was going on. Don't know what things were thinking. But now I'm on Epona and we can just get a Leon Doodle Darn out of here. If that makes any sense. Probably does not. Probably makes uh, gibberish. I, I think that's a good word. Yeah, gibberish is a nice word to use. And I will show everyone the correct way in getting over the wall. I should. Oh, man. Yes, yes, yes. I think I went the wrong way. Yeah, it's, it's through here. Okay. My bad. Okay, the correct way of going over the wall instead of the little chi way I use with the Goron guy. This is the correct way to go over the wall. I have to use Epona to jump over the wall. And here we go! Man, the music really changed, didn't it? It's always so sad when that happens. Darn it, Epona! Think you can jump over that little wall? After all, you did just climb over that giant wall we were just passing. Okay! So, first things first. You can't hurt me. Okay. So, the grave is still here, even though I uh, technically haven't cured the dude yet. But that's okay. Oh, man. Okay. Next video. Not this video, because I'm already doing this. Um, I'm going to get new arrows. I might get a couple new hearts. And maybe one more bottle if uh, I get the hookshot in this video. Who knows, though? But anyway. Okay. Get down. Get down. Get down. I don't need you, Epona. No, not anymore, Epona. We have to part this place now. Okay. Now, where is Zora face? There's Zora face. Here we go. Okay. Then we just divey dive. I always love the Zora most because I love the fact that how fast he can swim like this. This is just awesome. He can do cool barrels. And this is just awesome, especially for the time it was made. It was just, the, it was just a great game. Like, this is, has to go down in one of my all-time favorite games ever. Like, ever, ever. Like, including everything. Check. You hold the sacred sword. Yep. I have an owl now. Yay. That is something good that we have done. Okay. Climb. 
climb. Okay, thank you. I didn't know if that was gonna let me climb for a second. Then we go visit this pirate dude. Let's see what the sign says. Marine or Marine Research Lab, researching water quality and marine life forms in Great Bay. And let me turn into Azora, just so I can talk to this guy uh, Zora to Zora. I think he's Azora. Maybe not. Oh, you finally came! I've been waiting for you. What about the eggs? I heard there is a total of seven. Hurry, put them in that aquarium. Okay, I don't have any eggs for you, sir. Do you like them poached or scrambled? You're late. What were the Zoras doing? Hmm. What is it, boy? Did you also come to watch the Zoro eggs hatch? I'm excited it. I'm excited about it too, but those important eggs haven't arrived yet. It takes about one to three days from the time Zora eggs are laid for them to hatch. But if they aren't kept in this aquarium until then, they might die. The reason for this is that the recent um, abnormal weather has caused the ocean temperature to rise in this region. Zora eggs are very sensitive to changes in the temperature. The only way the eggs can hatch is if they're placed in this aquarium water, which I set aside for them long ago. Man, you are long-winded, sir. Seriously, you don't need to talk that much about the eggs, man. The Zoras are well aware of this, but they're still late. I wonder if something has happened at Zora Hall. Well, jeez, dude, man, you have a lot to say. And I also like being this one because I feel like a lot older with the doors and everything because they're actually about the same size as I am now. Oh, oh I see a bottle. And also... And another reason that I like this worm is that this Zelda game does not come with a slingshot, but the Zora guy has slingshot arms, which I'll show in a second. Actually, I think I showed it in my uh, video of getting the golden scorches, but I'll show it again in a sec. Let me get this fairy. Got a fairy in a bottle, baby. Okay. Let me equip to this. Don't know why, I just wanted to. And then boom. And then I'll show you. Boom. And I can flip backwards while doing it, and flip go into the water. And I can dive in the water? I, I don't know why, Zora Form Link is one of my favorite. I can slingshot in the water, which is awesome. This is awesome, I love doing the fish thing like this. Well, that was weird, kind of glitchy, what, what? That was nice, I didn't mean to go that far. Oh man, I don't have a map for this region. Hey, Tangle! Get, yeah, you! Get down here! I need a map! Yeah, Great Bay! What? You don't have a discount? I will hurt you! Okay, that, that's enough of all good and fun. Okay, unequip this. I'm not really doing anything this episode, just getting acquainted with uh, some parts of the story. Darn it. Man, I can't even get you from here. Let me go right here. That should be a good spot. Yeah, that's a great spot. There we go. So I hope I don't hit you in the face, Tangle. There we go. Speak. What's this? Green clothes, white fur. Okay, we've been through this. Tangle, I know your backstory. Will you give me a map or not? Great bay, yes. Sir, I don't have enough rupees. Darn it! Um, okay, well, here goes nothing. Also, you can change into the Zora in water. You can't do that with others, or if you do, like, you drown, because the other two can't swim. Which is compensated by this, because you can swim really awesomely with this one. Uh, oh yeah, pirates! Yes, let's go there. Actually, no, not to pirates yet. Let's go to the Great Zora Hall, or whatever. I forget what it's called so much. Like, it, it's always there, but it's just not there. If you know what I mean. <laughs> this way? Pinnacle Rock. Um. Oh, yeah, you need a little uh, starfish dude to help you go somewhere, places. Yeah, I already. I was. I'm far off already. Um, I'm gonna go leaving right now. Yeah, thank you, sir. 
Oh, speak, speak, speak. Uh, another Zoro. Oh, hello, fellow Zoro. Miyaku, haven't you seen the gold colored fish around here? Gold colored fish know this area very well. I was thinking of getting one to guide me to Pinnacle Rock. If the water wasn't so murky, I wouldn't have to rely on the guidance of a golden colored fish. So that's a little hinty who. Um, uh, that I need a little, uh, gold colored fish, bro. And I keep hearing those seagulls. I love doing this. I'm such a dolphin right now. This is just awesome. I love being the Zora so much, if you can't tell. It's just so cool. So cool. So amazing. So amazingly cool. Okay. So anyway, uh, what else can I do here? Whoa. That's a rock. Climb up. Thank you. Well, this is going to take a while. Whoa. No, you can't touch this. Sorry, I can't. You're not gonna touch me right now. Okay, so let's go to the other side. I believe that's where the story is. Has anyone else seen the story around here? <laughs> that's a joke from DLC Quest if you haven't seen that video. Whoa, bouncy. That was awesome. Oh, hey, Epona, it's me, uh, Link. You may not recognize me in this form, but trust me, I am Link. Okay, so this is cool. Cool. I just want to show, this video is going to be like nothing is happening. I'm just going to show you around. Nope, can't touch me. Can't touch me. Let's talk. Hey, Miku. You want to do that thing you used to always do? What? Um, what are you talking about? What thing could you be talking about? Could it be this? Hold on, I can totally do this first. Try. One, two. Oh, what? I got all of them. Have you lost your touch from playing too much guitar, Miyaku? Didn't you used to be able to break all of these pots at once? Oh, come on, I did. The game just froze and it didn't. Darn it. Motion is still stiff like someone who's not used to doing this. Sorry, but I have to take 10 rupees from those broken charges. What? You don't even have 10 rupees? I guess there's nothing I can do. I'll just have to eat the loss. Well, I appreciate your consideration. Well, I'm gonna break more jars per the Link uh, way. I oh, mean, that was a bit too high. Well, I got both of those. Okay, I know you're telling me I'm bad at doing the jars. Blah, blah, blah. Let me just uh, move. There we go. That's a good spot. One, two, well, darn it. Oh, I love that move. The whole uh, roll while you're in the slingshot thing is so cool. Not slingshot, but uh, boomerang things. Oh, my fins, okay? Let me just uh, line up the shot. Boom! Come on. There we go! Way to go, Miku! You've got the big smirk on your face. Well, here's 100 rupees, except the jar equipment stands to allow the do that. 90 rupees! Challenge again sometime. Why, thank you. I know I may have broken your jars and didn't pay for them before, but I appreciate that you keep up your end of the bargain in uh, buying that 100. Because you know logic, right? Okay. I love doing the bouncy thing. Boing. 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 Okay. Okay, that was fun and all. Um, I'm gonna talk to Tangle one more time, and I think that's gonna be it for this video, because I need to keep this short right now, and we didn't really do anything, but I'm introducing you to Great Bay a little bit, so I guess we did do a little something. Boingy. I, I love doing the boingies. Okay, anyway. There we go, Tangle. Come on down, buddy. You can't fly like those seagulls. Come on down. There you go. Now, we need to talk. Yeah, I know. I'm a fairy boy. You want to be a fairy boy. Your father hates you. Let's get done with this already. Ha! <laughs> ha! Am I right? <laughs> okay. I've got some tingle fans out there. I'm sorry for offending you. Jeez. <laughs> Great Bay, please. Yippee! Great Bay, gotcha. Welcome again, Tingle Tingle Kolo Limpa! These are magic words I stole by myself. Don't steal them. Yes, sir. Hello, Mr. Fairy. Will you buy my maps? Yes. Stone Tower 2, please. 
Okay, now I have a lot of maps. Okay, nice, okay. And now you can see I have a map now, yay! Well, anyway, we got some stuff done. Well, not really, but, you know, I've showed you around the Great Bay. I got the map. Um, we did the jar game, which took me, surprisingly, not as many tries as I thought it would to do it. But anyway, this is going to be Obnonami, as Tangle's inflating his balloon. Signing off!